Let's talk about tally charts. First, let's talk about tally charts. It's pretty simple to make. I'm sure any kid my age can do it. Well, a tally chart is used to record and organize information. We can use it to count the number of things in a group. The lines are called tally marks. The first four lines are drawn from up to down or vice versa, but the fifth line goes across the four lines before they start a whole new set. Let's try this. Can you use tally marks to count the number of Pac-Men? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. So there are seven Pac-Men in all. Let us try another one and try to know how many more ninja stars are there than triangles. One, two, three, four, five. There are five ninja stars. One, two, three. There are three triangles. So there are... Two more ninja stars than triangles. In Mr. Scott's class, students must choose which sport they will enroll in for PE. Five students chose soccer, four students chose basketball, three students chose running, seven chose swimming, and one chose archery. Create a tally chart to represent this data. Let's make our tally chart. We're gonna have the sports on the left and the tally on the right. First we have soccer. Five students chose soccer. Next we have basketball. Four students chose basketball. Now we have running. Three students chose running. Then we have, you guessed it, swimming. Five and two. So seven students chose swimming. And finally we have archery. Only one student chose archery. See, it isn't difficult after all. Try this on your own. In Miss Shelley's second grade class, 15 boys like robots, 5 boys like planets, 10 boys like fireworks, and 20 boys like arcade games. I know you can do it! Thank you!